If you're a woman and you work in a field in which you have to wear x-ray protective lead, listen to this video. Did you know that female orthopedic surgeons have a four times higher risk of breast cancer than the general population? That's because in orthopedic surgery and in spine surgery like myself, we are exposed to a lot of x-ray. Radiation exposure is a known carcinogen and the closer you are to the x-ray machine, the higher your exposure. When I'm in the operating room, I stand right beside the x-ray machine during the procedure and we take x-rays throughout the case to ensure that we're placing hardware in the right position. We get exposed to this radiation day in and day out. This is an example of well-fitted radiation protection and I had this custom fitted to my body, but what I want you to note is the amount of protection I have in the axillary region of my breast. Most people don't have custom fitted lead or even women's fitting lead. And what we normally have to do when we're in the OR is just find whatever's available and throw it on. This is the kind of lead that we normally find, which is just a overfitted extra large lead that we just throw on and we think we're getting protected but really our axilla and our breast tissue is getting constantly exposed. This has been shown in papers such as this publication that was done in 2016. The most common location of the breast cancer is that upper outer quadrant, which may not be adequately shielded by our radiation protection. And the common position that we're standing in in the operating room is right by the C-arm in a side position where the radiation beams are coming in this direction. When I was a resident, this was a common theme. I just picked up whatever lead I could find and put it on and I didn't even think twice about it. So the point of this video is just for awareness and transparency because for years, I didn't even think about protecting my breasts from constant radiation exposure in the operating room. We also need to be our own advocates and advocate for well-fitting x-ray protection lead that is fitted for a woman and not for a man. In a male-dominated field, we often don't want to be the squeaky wheel, but it's for our own protection. This is not just for surgeons as we are the closest to the CRM, but it's for every woman that wears lead to be cognizant of the protection of your axilla during radiation exposure. Speak up and be your own advocate. And feel free to share this video because knowledge is power.